Aloha, we know what time it is. Shot from the heart, and it's stretching time. So we got 10 minutes of stretching. Check out my little Aloha shirt. I think this is what I, my new attire is gonna be, is doing workouts with my Aloha shirts. I love my Aloha. Aloha to all of you. Today we're gonna be with the ball the whole time. Okay, we're gonna do 10 minutes stretching on the ball. So if you have a ball, grab a ball. If you don't, you're gonna have to use a mat or figure something out. But 10 minutes, all on the ball, some good stretching, going up the whole entire body. Hey Google, set alarm for 10 minutes. Hey Google, set alarm for 10 minutes. There, your alarm set for today at 11.27 wow. a.m. Isn't listening to me. Man, this AI stuff, man, woo. It's all good. The AI is up there, okay. So, settle in, breathe in, let that body expand, open up, and release. Good, deep breath in, let the belly open up. Expansion, exhale, release. Get your center. Take your mind right to the center of the breastbone at the heart level. Feel the energy there, and feel your expansion as you breathe. Next inhale, look up toward the ceiling. Exhale, chin toward the chest. Again, just ride that breath. Starting off in the neck, going down the body, loosen up. Start stretching, opening up. Look to the center. Look over the left shoulder, back to the center, and then to the opposite side. Again, let your shoulders relax. Breathe. Exhale. And you look to the side. Back to the center. Roll the shoulder blades up, back, and then down. Again, feel that breath. Roll the shoulders. Lift up. Isolate in your shoulder muscles. Try to stay steady on the ball and just feel the shoulders moving. Opposite direction, same thing. That upper arm bone rolling in the socket. Feel the freedom loose in the neck. Back to the center with the shoulders and then lift up. Breathe in. Exhale, release. Again, breathe in. Expansion, open up, release. Tension right at that center of the breastbone. There we go, and open up that heart, that energy of the heart. Release, back down, let those shoulders center. Okay, we're gonna walk to the side. We're gonna open up the obliques. So, on your knees, bring the ball right to the hip bone, okay? Cradle that ball, then extend the legs out, okay? Stack your ankles. You can hold your feet down and kind of get your balance. Now take that right hand and bring it up and over. There we go. Bring it back. Bring it to the hip. Walk up just a little bit more. Bring over that ball. Bring the hand up. And again, lean over. Open up. Look to the inside of that right upper arm. Bring that right hand back up. There we go. Just a little bit more, see if you can. If you can extend that left hand, extend that left hand. If not, stay with it. Reach over. Open up the bleats. On the side, open up. And then back with that right hand, back down. Pull it back down and take it over to the opposite side. Same thing. Again, right there. Hip bone, right into the ball. Extend the legs out. Cradle your ball. Get your balance. Get your balance first. Once you have that balance, Put that foot down to kind of give you balance if you're not used to it. Left hand up, reach over. Look to the inside of the left upper arm. Open up those obliques. Muscles on our side, we're opening up right up in here. Let it open. Put the hand down. Then walk the feet up just a little bit more if you're able to. Left hand coming up. Find that balance. Steady on the ball. Reach that hand over. Look to the inside of that left upper arm. Back down, one more time. If you're able to, extend that right arm if you're able to. Left hand up and over. Oh, nice little pop there, so good. Stretch it out, lean. If this is too much for you, drop down to that level one or two. Bring that left hand back down. Drop down to that right knee. Coming back up. Okay, again, sitting on the ball. Up to the ball. We're going to go into the lower back. Breathe in. Feet parallel, stack the knees and the ankles. 
Now breathe in, bring your hands up over the head. Lengthen. Now as you exhale, like that swan dive, bring your hands down to your side, wrap your hands up under your knees, fold forward, exhale out. Now as we inhale, pull onto your wrist and then pull the torso forward. Sit down on the ball, exhale, fold deeper in between the legs. Just let yourself release downward. Inhale, smoothly come back up, ride that breath in. Bring your head up and over the head again. Ride that breath. Palms facing one another. Lengthen the arms straight up overhead. Exhale. Let them back down. Awesome. Okay, right hand out. Bring that elbow toward the neck. Left hand slightly pressing just below the elbow, stretching out that shoulder, the rotator cuff muscles. Release. Take it to the opposite side. Left hand out. Bring the crease of the elbow right into the neck. Slight pressure with that right hand. Slight pressure. Again, release. Okay, I'm going to turn sideways so you can see. Bring your hand behind the back. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Now roll your shoulder blades up, back, and then down. Extend the arms out. Now fold forward at the waist. Keep the knees stacked over your ankles. Keep folding. Far down as you can. Now when you can't fold anymore, you're going to breathe in and lift those arms up and rotate those shoulders up and over the head as much as you're able. Back up. Slowly breathing in, bring those hands back down. Release the arms. There we go. Right into the hips. This is my fun one. I love this one. You're going to love it too. Okay, now on the hips. So you're just going to roll around the ball. Okay, if you want to feel this, put your hands on your knees and just roll. Push the hip out to the right, the butt out, back, and over to the side. Then push the pelvis forward. Slow motion. Here I'm going to go. Slow motion. So in the front, pelvis moves forward, right hip out, butt to the back, left hip out, pelvis to the front. That's your roll. There we go. Opposite direction now. Feel the roll in the pelvis. There we go, slow motion, pelvis to the front, hip to the side, butt to the back, right hip out, forward, roll it around, right into the hips, awesome, okay, come back to the center, awesome, okay, we to roll out, go ahead and sit on your mat on the floor, almost there, now, hamstrings, we're working hamstrings, the back of the thighs, and down to the side, roll that ball in as close as you're able to. Now, lift the pelvis up into the air. Now extend the leg straight out. Try and get a straight line from your ankles, your knees, your hips, and your shoulders. Now tighten up the quads, in front of your thighs, tighten them up, tighten them up. Now let them release and lower the pelvis down. Awesome, now walk the ball out. This time, what you're gonna do, left leg down on the mat. Roll the ball up under the right knee. Okay? Take that right leg up over the ball. Now, lift up, hand up over the head. As you exhale, I want you to lift up and grab the ball. Hold on to the ball. Extend that right leg up into the air. Pull into the ball, pull the chest to the leg. There we go, pull in, release, slowly back down. Okay, bring that left leg up over the ball. Right leg out to the side, and up and over the head. One, two, three, lift yourself up, grab onto the ball, extend that left leg up, pull the chest toward the thigh. There we go, flex that left ankle, pull that chest toward, release, slowly back down. Both legs on top of the ball again. Okay, heels to the ball. Lift the pelvis up. Align the ankles, knees, and the shoulders. Lift it up. Slowly back down. Awesome. Here we go. Come back up. Okay. Shift up the thighs. Gonna come up to over the ball. Roll up so that you're on your knees. Ball is right at your knees. Now bring the knees in toward the chest. Forms like you're sitting on your heels. 
Pull it back out. Again, bring the knees in, back the shoulders, the elbows, and then wrist. Extend back out. There we go. Coming off the ball. Sit back down onto the ball. Shake out your wrist. Last piece. Roll the wrist around. Turn your wrist to the outside. Get your breath. Take your attention right to the center of the breastbone. Turn the wrist in the opposite direction. Feel the energy at the center of the breastbone. Breathe. Let the hand relax. Bring the hands right down to the knees. Hey Google, alarm off. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out, release. Hey Google, alarm off. As you breathe in this time, lift the shoulders up. As you exhale out, just lightly let the shoulders come back down. Find your center. Come back to that heart energy. Awesome. Ugh. That's nice and smooth. Stay with the heart energy. In the body, in the human body, the heart energy is the most powerful energy. Come from the heart, tap into the heart, the energy in the brain, that pineal gland, and we get this heart-brain coherence. Keep with us. Go ahead. Hit the next video over to the left, or you want to subscribe, to the right. Hit the logo. You're there. Aloha, my friends.